there became lots of issues at the public school for Samuel. I was getting reports of bullying, letting me know that my son um, was being assaulted in the bathroom. And finally, Sam let me know. And it wasn't until I saw the bruises that I said, enough, we're done. Every single day when I would drop off his younger sister, he would say, I would really like to go to school there too, mom. And I'd have to say to him, they don't have a special needs program. And I just kept thinking, oh my gosh, there's, there's gotta be an option. And uh, it was in 2008 when I made a phone call down to Columbus and spoke to School Choice Ohio. And I said, you know, there's a scholarship for individuals with autism. There's a scholarship for typical developing students. Shouldn't there be options for every student? And they said, well, today's your lucky day. There's actually a bill in front of the legislature right now. Would you be willing to come down and testify? And I said, well, I don't know what that means, but sure. By not providing school choice to all students, we are leaving out some of our most vulnerable students, and that is our children with special needs. That was where things started to change for us. That bill passed in the state of Ohio and was vetoed by our then governor. And I just felt so defeated. And I thought, my son deserves an education just like everyone else. And they reintroduced what then became the Peterson bill um, five short months later. And it was a lot of work. And um, I'm gonna get emotional, but it was, it was in June. I got up in the morning and my emails came through and there was an email from School Choice Ohio that said, you did it. I think she's had an incredible impact. Even when she started with us, she was writing the curriculum, training students, slowly getting children one by one, but then simultaneously, she was equally pursuing school choice at the state house level in Columbus, Ohio. And so for her to move from MCS to statewide to national is exciting for all of us. Good evening. My name is Tara Myers. As we look at the students with special needs and the choices that need to be available for them for obvious reasons, and then we say, you know what, this is also true of every child. To have a school that fits that need is a big win. Our school system is designed as a one-size-fits-all, but that's not how our children are. Our children are fearfully and wonderfully made. They're unique. They all come with different experiences and different backgrounds. Each child is individual and the parents and the family know their children the best. In a particular setting, some students may prosper and do wonderfully, but then another student, it just might not be the best situation for